everybody, welcome back to another episode of our Horsemanship 101 series presented by Hanson Dam Riding School. Today we'll be shooting a three-part mini-series about how to saddle, bridle, and untack your horse. Boots protect the horse's legs while they're working. Front boots protect the tendons and fetlocks from being hit by the hind hooves, while back boots protect the fetlocks from hits by the other hind leg. When you put boots on, squat down or bend next to the leg. Keep your feet on the ground, don't kneel or sit to make sure you can get out of the way if necessary. When boots are on properly, the Velcro fastener will be on the outside of the leg, and the straps will be pulled across the front of the leg, then towards the tail on the outside. Slide the boot onto the leg a little high, then slide it downwards into place to make sure all the hair is going the right direction. Then open the fastener and pull the straps evenly across the front of the leg. Once they're fastened, smooth the upper Velcro strap over the top to lock the boot in place. To check the tightness, stick your pinky finger in between the leg and the elastic. It should feel snug, but not suffocating. Boots that are too tight, too loose, or placed wrong can affect your horse's performance and comfort, so always make sure they're on correctly. With hind boots, the shell goes on the inside of the fetlock, while the Velcro goes on the outside. The strap that pulls it tight goes towards the tail on the outside. Like the front boots, put the back boots on higher than they need to go. Then, fasten the Velcro. Pull the elastic strap around to the outside of the leg, towards the tail. Make sure you do both the under and over Velcro to secure the boot. Then, pull the boot down into place. It should sit just around the fetlock. To take off the front boots, squat safely next to the leg, just like before, and pull up the Velcro anchor strap. Then, just undo the Velcro straps and pull the boot right off. To store the boot, fold the elastic straps on one boot into the shell, then put it inside of the other boot. Do the straps just like when you put the boots on a leg, and then put them away. Be sure the boots are dry when you put them away so they don't get moldy and irritate the horse's legs. Remove back boots in the same way. Squat safely, undo the anchor Velcro, and pull off the strap. To store, fold the straps on one boot, then put it inside the other one. Then you can redo the Velcro. Storing them this way, you'll always have a pair ready to go. I hope you enjoyed this episode of Tony's Tack Tips. Thanks so much for tuning in. If you liked what you saw, be sure to hit that like button and subscribe so you don't miss any of my new content. If you have any questions or ideas of content you'd like to see or things you'd like to learn, comment below and I'll try to make it happen. Thanks so much for watching and remember to always ask why.